Assalamu alaikum. Welcome to step 3 of the application process. Uh, before I continue on step 3, I want to make sure you have completed a step 1 and step 2. In case you have not done completed it yet, please finish the step 1 and step 2. Here are the links. Click directly on step 1 and if you have already completed it, you do not have to do it again and on step 2, you, you enter your cell phone number. Just in case you missed it, please, please, please consider it finishing this up if you just come to step 3 directly and by skipping a step 1 and step 2 your application will not be considered so you may even close your browser now in case uh, you are skipping any steps I, we want to make sure all of our applicants students potential students complete the process as instructed step 1 step 2 and step 3 so having enough said that, welcome to step 3, the, thank you so much for taking your time. This In this application we are going to ask you a number of questions, so please take your time to finish this application. So I am going to guide you a little bit. So here you first enter your full name and then you enter your primary email. This is the same email which you ap applied on uh, step 1 and step 2. And then you enter your cell phone number here, your own mobile number and then your father's complete name and then your father's mobile number, mobile phone. So we may even contact and speak with your father directly. And then we need your home address so our representative can contact you regarding your application status and plus uh, we may have with, of course with the appointment, we our representative may even visit uh, your family, you know, with your permission of course and your city and your district. City is like a tehsil and because many cities in Pakistan have a small city like a Sumundri is a tehsil and Faisalabad is a district and if you are in Lahore, your tehsil and the district both are Lahore, Lahore, so it's okay. So and province, which province you are from, Balochistan, Pakhtun, Khyber Pakhtunkhwa, Punjab, Sindh or if you are from Islamabad, you can write others in Islamabad. And this is, next thing is CNIC number, that's like a Nadra card number. So you just enter your number without any dashes and if this is a 13 digit number with no dashes or hyphens. And if you don't have a Nadra card number at this time, I'm sorry we cannot accept your application at this time. So you, you need to have a Nadra card number to verify your identity. So we just need the number right now, however we will get your uh, copy of your a Nadra card number later, not at this moment. Please do not submit to us. So after your Nadra card number, we need your social media profiles. The first one is Skype ID. If you have the already ID, just enter it here. If you don't have one, so you can sign up at skype.com and it's free. We would need so we can communicate with you via Skype. And your Facebook link. So Facebook link is like uh, facebook.com slash uh, ours is the Pakistani Social Entrepreneurship Academy. If you click on this one, uh, so you please provide your Facebook link. Please like our page and uh, it is, uh, and so please provide the complete link. So we want you to like our page and provide your Facebook, Facebook link so we can actually look at your profile on Facebook. So if you click on that, you just need to say like here and you're done. So I'm going to go back and the next thing is your LinkedIn profile link. Please provide us your LinkedIn profile, please join our group. So we want you to join our group on LinkedIn. So if you don't are not already signed up on LinkedIn, LinkedIn is a professional network place where you should be on a LinkedIn. If you don't have already, you need to sign up on that one. It's free. Once you sign up on that, join this group. Our, here is our group. I'm going to click and show you. You simply join on that group and that's it. And then the next thing is a Google Plus profile. So Google Plus is like if you have a Gmail, your Google, you already have a Google Plus, so you turn it on and if you click on this link, I, we want you to follow our Google Plus. You click on this link, you see our Google Plus page. You can, we just created this one and I'm sure there will be many, many followers as th through this process. So Google Plus and the Twitter ID. So our Twitter ID is PC uh, official. 
So if you click on this and just hit follow on that one, we want you to follow us on Twitter. So again, quick recap, we need your Skype ID, Facebook ID, LinkedIn ID, and Google Plus ID and Twitter ID. So if you don't have some of them, it's time to sign up and follow up on that because this is a very required thing in this whole what we are going to teach you later. So we want you to have it before you even start the whole process. Then next thing is, we there are a number of computer skills and we understand that you may not have all of them in case, let's say you have a graphics logo design, you know how to logo design, you just click on that and like a checkbox and then maybe you don't know anything about marketing, read all of them, if you know something, check it only, please check those skills which you already have, not what you plan to learn later. So you may, we understand you may know only one, two, three things only from this, but these are, this is a very exp extensive list here and uh, like a WordPress website, some may you know how to test websites, somebody know how to e-commerce, some may you may know already how to advertising, banner designing and radio and you know there's so much. So this is for everyone, so you may know only few skills, however, because the next question we are going to ask you how you learn those skills. So you can skip everything else which you don't know, but we want you to go through every one of them which you already know. And three, four, five, six skills is good enough. You don't need too many. This is probably 80 different skills we listed here. So the next question is, what steps you have taken to educate yourself on the above skills? So whatever you have chosen from the top list, we want to know how you learned that one. Have you gone to a school, college, or learned from on the job while they got some private courses, we want to know how you earn, uh, learn those skills because if you may have a computer diploma, you may have a master degree or bachelor degree in MCS or anything regarding a computers, we want to know because you have to prove this one to us uh, that you know those computer skills. So <clears throat> then of course you write this, that gives you the opportunity to write how you learn those skills and then the next step is, it's a very very important, hopefully you are, we are almost done now about your Social Entrepreneurship Academy training impact. We are almost done on this application, however, there are two more imp most important questions. We want to know why are you ready now to start earning dollars using your own computer? So three to five line answer is good enough and no need to write an essay here. Once you have written here, please do post an answer to our Facebook page. So we will be reading it from a Facebook page as well. Here is a link again for you, you can just click and and we want you to uh, post it here, just like hey, I am ready to you know to make money online now because I have the right skills. Whatever you want to say, I don't want to give you word what to say. Please write in English, not in Roman, uh, Urdu, or Punjabi, or Pashtun, or Sindhi, because we do not uh, know. Because many of the donors who are from all over the world, the sponsors who are paying on your behalf, they only read English, so they will be reading your uh, responses over there. So you want to write a language where everybody else understand outside and, and plus when you will be working, you are writing uh, all the work is in English, so it's not in local language, so we want you to start thinking on that one. You don't have to speak much, however writing and reading, I know in, I, I went to school in Pakistan, in fact the last degree I had a master's in computer science from Kajim University Islamabad, that was all from Pakistan, never really went to school here in US. So I do know we, even though I was not able to speak English well at that time, forget I can't even speak English well right now. So this is like, a, however we can read and write well in schools if you are good in your, uh, your education. So it's only three to five lines. We want to know why you are ready right now. Three to not not too much a big one. And the next, we want you to post that, post it here in this box first. Then copy paste and post it on Facebook too. Only post once, please. Don't post it over and over the same thing. Then the next question is: Upon successful completion of the training, you should start earning dollars online, like money making money online. What specific impact this extra income will have on yourself, your family, or any other significant other than your, you know, in your uh, friendship? So again, 
first we want to know why you are ready right now and this one we want to know what once you start making money online what impact it will have in your family in terms of extra income what problem it will solve and we want to, we want you to write it here and plus post this one on a linkedin so again here is a linkedin link and just post on a discussion so because on the previous step you already have the linkedin profile you are already a member to the group by now and then you just click on this discussions and uh, like a start a discussion just write it here title and you know a small description again three to five lines and then growth intentions from one to ten we want you to know that how aggressive you are ready and your readiness is to actually work on this one how is this a priority or just may happen so one being the least that means you are not really interested at all 10 being very aggressive you are 100 percent committed to do this be honest with yourself because we are going to know as you actually progress through the application if you say 10 here and you don't even finish the next step you are not being honest to yourself well, let me tell you you are only lying to yourself you have to be honest with yourself for us it doesn't really matter if, if we are only going to pick people who are going to follow through and say what they feel instead of just making up the answer so be honest to yourself every time and then the next question the time integrity when you will schedule a meeting with you are you do you show up on time delayed and whatever the option you do, you do and then click submit then once you submit congratulations you submitted the application this is again a step three and I will be back with you on the next step.